Hello YouTube, this is Krishna and you are watching Tech Flash. Many of you guys might be using Moto G4 Plus and wondered what if I could change my OS to any other custom OS in which I can customize my phone according to my personal preference. So I am here with this video in which I will be telling you few things about Invicta OS which is so far the most stable and customizable ROM available for Moto G4 Plus. And I'll also tell you how to install it on your Moto G4 Plus, so watch the video till the very end. So guys Invicta OS is based on Lineage OS with some extra cool features and it is developed by Shailesh Nair, a XTA developer. It comes with neat overall user experience and I think it's all that matters. This ROM is my favorite because it offers more nifty features than stock ROM or any other ROM. As clean as the OS, all the extra features are placed in separate menu called additional features. Here you can play with bunch of settings, you can totally change your way of customization. Normal Moto Display and Moto Actions are already available with this ROM. So don't worry, every basic thing is pre-installed. This was everything you need to know, now let's see how to install it. Before you install the ROM, you will need a custom recovery on your phone and two zip files which are given in the description box below, so do check it. Once you are done with the downloads, place the ROM zip file on your preferred location. Now reboot your phone to TWRP recovery. I suggest you to backup your previous ROM by selecting backup options and then tick mark the system data and boot and then select the storage where you want the backup file to be saved. Now just swipe the down bar and the backup will be started. If in any case you are stuck in a boot loop or your device is not tending to start, you can restore your previous ROM easily. Once you are done with that, now go back to the menu and select wipe options and then advanced wipe. Here tick mark system catch it dial weekend data and swipe. This will wipe your previous ROM. When it's done, go back to the menu again and select install and navigate to the files where you have saved them.
you can also toggle between SD card and internal storage here. Once you're done with the navigation, select the Invicta OS.zip file. Now select add another zip. Here add gapps.zip file and swipe. This will start the flashing process and may take around 10 to 15 minutes. Congratulations, now your phone is running on Invicta OS. The first boot will take some time to start the device, so don't worry. And that's all for this video guys, hope you liked it. If you have any questions, you can leave them in the comment section below. And make sure you subscribe to this channel to see more tech related videos. Thank you for watching the video and hope to see you in the next one.